What's up guys, it's Raf, back in the Raf cave with another LG OLED slash PlayStation HDR gaming video. Uh, this is a video I'm going to do for you guys um, that have some questions on how to set your OLED to PC input mode uh, to take more advantage of uh, PC's 444 Chroma and other uh, graphical high quality performance out of your TV. All right, so for PC and gaming, I would suggest putting your input that you most use in PC mode. So to do that, we want to hold the input button down on your remote. And that brings it to the home dashboard. So the first thing you want to do is go up top here to settings and you want to edit. Now what you want to do is change the input symbol, the icon. So you click on the input that you're going to use for PC or gaming, one of the four. Click that icon you want to use that input on. And you want to choose down at the bottom, PC. Select that. And then I'll make this particular input in PC input mode to take full more advantage of graphical quality. All right, guys. So do that first. I'd recommend it even for video games. So we'll back out of that. And you want to save it, of course, and all that, all that jazz. So now let's get into setting your PlayStation system to take full advantage of HDR graphics. Let's get to that right now. Okay. So now that we're on the PlayStation home screen, what you want to do is go up to your settings. Hey, Abby. Go to your settings. You go down to sound and screen. You go to video output settings. And you want to go adjust HDR. Okay, so select that. So you want to go next. That puts your TV into HDR mode. Now, what I always suggest, if you have PlayStation and the LG OLED, is you go to HGIG mode. And what you do is you go into game mode. You go down to Advanced Controls and Dynamic Tone Mapping, HGIG on. All right. So once HGIG is on, we're in the Adjust HDR screen. So what's important here on this first screen is it says to have the your brightness darker and brighter until the logo is almost invisible. So right now there is no logo. There's your logo. So what you want to do is you want to go until it's completely invisible. You cannot see it. And then go one tick darker. Okay? That's that's correct. Almost invisible. to one tick from invisible. So you do that. Now you go into this screen. Where's the logo? Right there. Okay? So you want to bring it down until it's invisible. Until you can't see it. And then go one tick over until you see it. Okay, now we're in the dark dark spot of the HDR. Where's the symbol? There it is, all right? So you go down into it, it's invisible. You can't see it no more. It's absolutely gone. And then you go one tick. Well, for the dark areas, I'm going to go up about two ticks. So one, two. And let's see, right about there. Two ticks from invisible. One, two, two ticks. And that's it. You're done. Your HDR is optimized. So for, from now on, all your HDR games are going to be completely the best possible way uh, to see them. All right, guys. Hope this helped you out. Enjoy it. Of course, LG OLEDs are amazing. The best next-gen gaming TV. Can't wait to go PS5, Xbox Series X on this GX OLED. Oh, my goodness. It's going to be crazy. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, share. You guys have a great day. Until next time, home theater rules. Raffo, see ya.